Alright, today I am going to show you how to play uh, Pokemon and Ingress split screen. Now, in the if you have a playing split screen in portrait mode, Ingress has some of the buttons go off the side of the screen and you can't interact with some of them. However, you can play it in landscape mode. Uh, Ingress is a little bit more finicky to get working in landscape mode, but Pokemon works perfectly fine resized split screen portrait or landscape. Um, the first thing you need to do is first you need to make sure you're running Android 7.0 Nougat. Second thing you need to do is turn on your developer options. To do this, open up your settings. Scroll down to the bottom. If you see developer options, you have already enabled this and can skip to the next step. Otherwise, tap about phone and scroll to the bottom again. Tap the build number 10 times and it will tell you that the developer options have been unlocked. Mm -hmm. Back up to the main settings page and tap developer options. Scroll all the way to the bottom. This action here at the bottom, force activities be resizable. Some apps will not allow you to use them in split screen, such as Ingress and Pokemon. This option, turning on this option, forces that to be enabled. Go back, make sure Pokemon and Ingress are both loaded. Go back home. Tap the mm -hmm. app list button. Select Pokemon, touch and hold, drag it all the way to the top. It'll tell you the app may not work with split screen, but you know what? It in this case it does. Tap ingress. It'll take a second to load. Rotate. Tap your app list. Tap Pokemon. Tap Ingress. If Ingress loads off to the side, you will see it just uh, just a sliver of it over here, and the rest of this will be blank. If that's the case, rotate back to portrait, then back to landscape, and Bring up your app list and tap Ingress again. There you have it. Ingress and Pokemon side by side. You will notice that the animation on the inactive side stops. Basically the uh, inactive window is frozen. So you want to switch back and forth occasionally to make sure you get all of your walking distance and what have you. As you can see Pokemon loads up just fine when the uh, network is fast. You can get gear. You can capture Pokemon. I'd show you if one would spawn. You can interact with all of your menus normally. Ingress, on the other hand, uh, is about 90-95% 90, 90, playable split-screen. From the main menu, you can do all the normal things, such as view the, uh, view the com, tap the portals. Now, on the portal screen, the actual uh, touch-responsive areas for these, button, for these buttons are lower than they should be. If you see here, I'm touching the hack button and the hack button is not highlighting saying it's active. Go a little bit below it.
Same with everything all the way down. You need to touch basically one button down. That means you will not be able to tap the OK button. You'll need to tap the back button instead. I don't want to do that yet. Uh, the same thing will apply for the uh, for the link button once it's available. You'll need to tap down below it to make it work. You can fire the XMPs normally. In the display in the deploy screen, you can tap all the individual radar uh, resonator slots normally and deploy them. However, you will notice that the uh, resonators are hiding behind the two buttons, which do respond normally in this case. You'll need to basically drag just above, basically where the, uh, just above where these, um, where those buttons are. And of course it's showing me as, there it goes. So if you need to select individual resonators, you, you drag right about there. Mod seems to reply normally, though in this case, instead of being behind the buttons, the items are in front of the buttons. But you can still tap the buttons in the correct in the correct spots. You'll need to aim a little bit below the uh, the list of mod items, though. Tap back. Max, oh well. You get the point. You can play them both side by side normally. You'll need to switch back and forth in order for them to uh, update. But in other words, but basically both of the games are, are purple, more or less perfectly playable. Oh, hey, here's a Pokemon that popped up. I think I'll give this guy a raspberry first. I don't really need him, but I just want to make sure I catch him for the video. And there we go. Poof, he's gone. Okay. You get the point. Hope this helps you. Have a great day.